I'm just about to review one of the most creative ways you can make money using the Art Breather in 2023 and beyond, so let's get started. I'm sure that some of you watching this video already know how this works. Now, to put it simply, this is a tool powered by artificial intelligence that will allow you to create some really impressive art, even if you're not an artist. And as soon as you connect to the website, you can start using a few different features. The first one of them allows you to draw shapes and upload images, and it is going to turn that into a pretty impressive result to say the least. It can do an amazing job. But for today's method in particular, we are interested in the so-called splicer because this feature on artbreeder.com allows us to upload multiple different pictures and it will combine them. It will mix those pictures together and their genres as well and will create a unique new result. Not only that, but you can also control certain features such as the age of that person depicted in the image, the gender, and things of that kind. You can have a lot of fun while playing with those. And do not worry about it, it is a totally free tool. Meaning that you get three image downloads, unlimited images, and five high resolution downloads for zero dollars. So you don't have to spend a single penny. Now, as we start making some money using this tool, you can obviously upgrade and get the advanced package or even a champion one. I'm gonna leave that up to you. But for now, we're just gonna use the free version of Art Breather and see what it can do. Not only that, but I'm gonna walk you through the entire process one step at a time so you can just follow along. This video is nothing but a tutorial. That being said, I won't bore you with the sign up process because that's pretty easy. All you gotta do is enter in your basic details here, your credentials, and then click on create account. Or you can just sign up with Google. And once you have successfully signed into your account, a world of different possibilities will open up. At this point, there are so many things you can do. And you can also take a look at what other people are working on. <laughs> I gotta tell you, some of these are pretty cool. What you wanna do next is click on the plus sign and then either choose the collager or the splicer. And you want to go for the second option. Remember, this is what we're interested in. We want to upload different pictures and we want the art breather to combine those pictures. And we're going to get a very unique result. Now, here's what I'm going to do next. As you can spot, there are a few different options you can choose from. But you want to go to the upload section and then select portraits. This is the niche we're going to be focusing on and that's for a really good reason. Let me show you why. In order to help you understand what we are going after, I want you guys to connect to Etsy.com for a second and then head over to the art and collectibles section and you will notice something very interesting here if you scroll down and you take a look at the best sellers you're gonna notice that the people who have the most sales here are the ones who can create custom art this is a great example of that you see this artist this seller on etsy.com is taking orders from people the customers will upload pictures of their pets and the seller will turn those pictures into watercolor paintings and as you can see it is pretty effective they are most likely doing this themselves and they are very talented and I would not recommend that you try to compete against them because they've already built a reputation, so it will be pretty difficult. This is a bestseller. However, we can reverse engineer what they are doing and we can take an important lesson from there. And that is the fact that if you can add a personal touch to whatever you are selling, that is going to make your products or services a lot more appealing. Here's another very similar one, and I could keep on going here for ages, but I actually got a few different case studies lined up. Another great example of someone who's just Taking custom orders is this seller right here. Whenever somebody purchases their services, they will also upload a picture of their pet and this seller will turn that into a very funny portrait, depicting them as a historical figure. As you can see, there's no need for me to explain what's going on here because it is pretty obvious, but it's also very effective. And as you can tell, this would make an amazing gift. That was just one example. Here's another one. This other seller is taking people's photos and turning them into anime characters. Again, this is a custom order. People can upload their pictures and the seller will create this design specifically for them. But there's more to it than that. I want you guys to take a look at the price. If you want to send Van Wolf here a picture of your pet and you want them to turn it into one of these portraits, you would have to pay about $35 or so, a little bit more than that. But that is just for the digital painting. This is a digital file. If you actually want to get a canvas, you're gonna have to pay about 60 euro, 100 or even 125, or you can also get a poster. And I'm gonna show you how you can do that as well. But for now, let's just take a step back and go back to Art Breather. 
because you can do something very similar to that using AI, even if you're not an artist. Guys, remember Artbreeder allows you to upload pictures and it will merge them. And that opens up a very unique possibility. What you can do is connect to Etsy.com and sign up as a seller. You can set up a custom gig just like these ones and allow people to upload pictures of them and their spouses. And using the art breather and a few other tools perhaps, we can actually see what a combination of the two people would look like. In other words, we can see what their kid would look like. And as you can tell, that's gonna be a pretty unique and a pretty cool gift. Let's just give it a try. What I'm gonna do is just download two random pictures of two people off of pexels.com because these are copyright free. And so this right here is gonna be the first person and this is our second person. Now I've just downloaded those two pictures and I'm simply going to re-upload them onto artbreather.com. Now don't worry about it, it may take a few minutes for the pictures to be uploaded, but once that is out of the way, you're good to go. And we can get the result delivered pretty fast. So let's give it a try. What I'm gonna do is add the first parent and then add the second one. You wanna go to the uploaded section and then pick the second one. And this is the result. Now keep in mind that this is just the first iteration, but we can keep on editing that until it actually looks good. As you can see, you can edit how much each of the parents will contribute to the result. So one of them may have a bigger contribution. You can also do the same thing with a style. Now we can do the same thing with the facial hair and we can add or remove it until we're satisfied with the result and I think this looks pretty cool. Let's do the same thing with the blonde hair and add a little bit more of that. Remember you're the artist here so you have full control. Now remember that you can also play with the gender so if you want to you can make this character a little bit younger as if they are a child which might be a little bit more impactful. Let's just say that these guys are preparing to be parents so they might be interested to see what their kid may look like and in this case this would be a potential result. And of course you want to play around with these features and until you have the best possible result, right? You don't just wanna send something like this to your client because that will be terrifying. And so will this. They are not gonna pay for that. You wanna balance these features until it actually looks realistic. Now, moving forward, people can place custom orders, they can send you their pictures and you can just plug them into the art breather. It's not gonna take you longer than five minutes to get one of these results done. And as you can see, you can get a pretty cool final result. And it doesn't take that much effort. I mean, a little bit of fine tuning will get you what you want. But now there's more to it than that. If you really wanna take this to the next level and maximize your profits, not leave any money on the table, you wanna do what these guys are doing, especially Van Woof here. As you can spot, they've got different options when it comes to the style. So instead of just selling the digital file, which is good, but it's not enough. You can take it to the next level and also print that design onto a canvas or a poster and you can charge a lot more for it. Now, you may think that this is difficult. You need to contact a local manufacturer and set things up. Perhaps you need some storage spaces. That's not the case. You can take advantage of the printing on demand model when it comes to that. If you connect to a website like Printful, Redbubble or Teespring, you can actually get these products done on demand. Meaning that whenever a client requests that custom canvas, you can connect to Printful and have it done for you. No inventory needed. And these guys will print your design onto a canvas. They will make sure that the print is high quality and they will also have the item delivered to your customer's door, which means that you don't have to worry about the shipping either. Now, if you really wanna maximize on the money you can make with this method, what you can do is connect to multiple different websites and not just depend on Etsy.com. You can also set up a gig on a freelancing website like Fiverr for a custom portrait, or you can even give it a different name. I'm gonna leave that up to you. And that's how you get in front of more people. So you get more exposure for your services. But the best part about it is that not only do you have a high quality result, but it doesn't take you too long to get it done. It is impactful. And you can also upsell people by having posters done and having canvases done and printing this digital design onto a physical item, which would make a great gift. You've got all the resources you need to make this work. That's it for now and thanks for watching.